Hi, I'm Greg Knockwood, host of the Greg Knockwood Show. You might also know me as Greg Knockwood, writer, producer, and director of the Greg Knockwood Show. Today, we have a top ten. Yes, we do. And, um, right there? And it's the top ten things to do in Wagoma. And it's presented by Pam Tony. Welcome to the show, Pam. Thank you, Greg. It's good to have you on. Great to be here. Awesome. You might take it? Sure. Okay, me and Tigger are going to say the Wego Box top 10 things to do in Wego Box. And I'll be counting it down. Okay, let's start. Number 10. Hang out at Rod's One Stuff. Number 9. Go to the fitness center and pretend you're working out. <laughs> ah, number 8. Hang out at the douchery and drink coffee. Ah, number 7. Go to the band office and pretend you have a meeting. Ah, number 6. Smile and wave to people even though they don't like you. <laughs> <laughs> Number five. Camp outside the welfare office on welfare day. <laughs> Number four. Hang out at Ross. Oh, wasn't that already on the list? <laughs> <laughs> Top thing. What else are we going to do like a bus? Ah, uh, that's true. Number three. Throw potatoes at your neighbor's dog. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Number two. Order at five, even though you can enjoy craft dinner at home. <laughs> and the number one thing to do in Wake is... Talk shit about your friends on Facebook. There you go. That's the top ten things to do in Wake Bay. Thanks for being on the show, Pam. Thanks for having me, Greg. And Tigger. You're very welcome. I'm Greg Knockman, and you're not. Hello. Wave, Keenan. <laughs>